Okay, so this is an infertile egg, and it's got little tips on it. And I'll show you guys what's inside this, but before we do that, I want you guys to feel that egg. It's all flexible and squishy. And now, this egg and this egg, the only difference is this has started to grow. And so, look how much bigger that is. So they start absorbing moisture, they start expanding inside, they're developing the, the veins and everything inside. And so they literally, can, the only difference, so this, this egg could have been this egg if it was fertile. Now this egg will continue growing and that's why they're soft, unlike a chicken egg. So it's going to take moisture in and use the moisture and all the protein and everything inside and just keep growing, growing until out comes a snake like I'm going to show you in about two minutes. And so these are all soft eggs and, uh, you know, chicken eggs obviously aren't soft, but reptile eggs are. I'm not sure if there's any any other animals that have soft eggs really but reptiles uh, alligators are kind of they're hard and and uh, so not everything there's no snakes that I'm aware of that have a hard shell at all gecko eggs some gecko eggs are soft and some gecko eggs have a hard shell on them and they actually stick to plants and different things so they don't fall off and die <laughs> you know what I mean that's and gecko eggs egg. are the same way that's, a bad egg. that's an infertile egg so I'm going to have JT put that away and I'm going to show you guys where you go. I'm going to show you guys what's inside this. Okay, everybody, this is really gross. It's actually unique. So this, I got to be careful because I don't want to spray anybody. That would be like not good, right? So you see that? The weird thing about this stuff is it's really, really, see there's no blood in it because it's an infertile egg. Just like if you get a chicken egg that's fertile, it's actually got blood inside. So I don't know if anybody's ever cracked an egg open and thought, oh my gosh. That was a fertile egg at some point. And chicken eggs are pretty amazing too because, oh, there we go. Chicken eggs are amazing too because they actually can sit on them, leave them off to the side cold, and then start incubating them, and then they'll take off. That's not true with snake eggs. If they get cold at any point during inside the female, they get sterilized, or outside the female, they get sterilized. So they basically die at any given point. So, and there we go. So this is the world's first right here. It's a real amazing snake. It's an orange ghost stripe titanium. Uh, I believe it to be a tiger. And this one right here, which I think is really close to coming out, this is a super tiger, plutonium. So they're very, very, very attractive snake. I'm very excited about the way they look. And, oh, see that? So he has, there's his belly button. It's almost completely done. And the amazing part about this clutch, the rest of this clutch hatched 15 days ago. And so this clutch, by the temperature being different, there was a 15-day gap in this, and they made it, and they made it to 100 days in their egg, which is really long. And that's one of the reasons why reticulated pythons don't do are the, some of the hardest snakes to breed because you have you, before they even lay their eggs, you have like 100, you have over 100 days inside the female, the right temperature, and then you have a, and in this case, 100 days outside, so they can't live in this area. They'll never live anywhere in the United States because one little temperature up and down, and they're, then they're basically sterile. So <clears throat> there's a plutonium, very good looking snake. And I'm kind of curious, I'm not positive, but if this snake turns out different than it looks, it could be an orange ghost stripe because it has some weird color, but I don't think so. So anyway, I thought you guys have fun, hopefully. What do you guys think? Is this wild? Yeah, it's awesome. Thank you so much. Anyway, hope you guys are having fun. Make sure you share a video anywhere you can and tag all your friends. And more, more importantly than anything, have a great day and a great week. Take care.